What's up, YouTube? Borderline is 50 here, and I'm today, which is actually the same day I just finished posting my other video, but this is part two of how to make your own YouTube intros on Android devices, okay? Before, I showed you about Animator, okay? Now, I had to do a little bit more extra research, and it turns out that, like, you don't just need Animator. Animator is what you use. Actually, yes, make the intro, but if you want to, like, add it with videos that you made and do and add music and all that specialties, uh, animator, the, uh, there's the music, but you can also use these two programs that I'm going to show you today. As you can see, they're also on the bottom of my screen. They're called Vitrim and Movie Editor, okay? Um, Vitrim, you can find in the Google Play Movie Editor, not so much. I will leave a link in the description for you guys to get Movie Editor, okay? So... Let's get started. After you make your little intro and animato, okay, you can come to Vitrim, and I'm going to give it a couple seconds because I've noticed it in my other videos, like how I said in part one, how I've noticed how these things have been acting a little bit laggy. I still haven't been able to fix that, fix that problem. If you guys have any other ways, if you think you can help me to fix that problem, go ahead. Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to go search all the way down to the video that you made, okay, obviously, like this, okay, and now this thing is loading up, okay, see how it says Vitrim for Android, and it shows up the photo right there, and as you can see, this is the intro that you've seen from, for this video, and the intro that you've seen from my previous video, okay, so what you do is you can cut pieces from it, so like you can skip parts, as you can see, like, how this is like this, yeah. Okay, now what you can do is you can start it from right there, and just like skip that part, and you can skip all the parts, so you just cut out the extra parts, okay? So that's how you use that part, okay? You can go back, I'm gonna go to this one, okay? And you can uh, change the color of your photos, like how they do it in cool little things. You can add text to it, rename it, and rename the profile. You can use settings to like add the video size, the video quality, and the audio that you want. Okay, and once you're done with that, okay, um, I'm just making sure that my video went back to um, the title screen. I'm still working on that at all, okay? Okay, and then now after you've used anim Animoto and Vitrim to cut your videos to make sure you have everything perfectly aligned the way you want, you're going to open Movie Editor. I'm going to click it, okay? Now this is my last video, so I am just going to click back, okay? I'm going to click back again. Okay, you're going to click movie. I'm gonna, okay, this should pop up after you download it properly. Okay, you're going to click the middle um, button. Okay, and it's going to ask you to place two. You're going to place your first video that you... First, you're going to put the... Sorry, <laughs> you're going to put the intro that you made from Animator first. Like that. Okay, it's going to say importing video. Now, your intro's there, and then you're going to click the one on this side. You're going to click it. And then you're going to add the video that you just made, okay? So let's say I chose this one, okay? Importing video now, okay? And this is how you combine your intro and your videos together, okay? And so, yeah, thank you, YouTube, for watching. And I think that thing just signed me out, okay? But that's cool. But thank you, YouTube, for watching. Now you know how to do it. Now I hope you guys make your own videos and enjoy. And don't forget to give a shout-out to me. I will be start leaving... Um, comments or like links in my description for you guys to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Tumblr, Instagram, all that amazing stuff. And Skype, don't forget to Skype. I Skype 24 7 every day, all day. I don't want to sound like a maniac too much though, but yeah, I like Skype. Skype is an amazing thing, okay? So thank you guys again for watching. And obviously, I'm gonna have to go through those three processes for um for <laughs> to make this video so I can be able to post this on YouTube from part two from part from part one to part two and I hope you guys like it and I will be making other videos in the future but if you guys would like me to make any specific videos please give me a shout out in the comments and just make like put um any video you want me to make you about like if you don't understand the way app works I will do the best I can to research it to do a video and show you guys okay so yeah and um 
if you guys have any games that you want me to figure out if it's available for your Android device or iOS product, just leave the game name in my comments. Okay, so just like let's say you want to know if there's Dead Space available for your Android, just type in the name Dead Space 3, 2, 1 or whatever, and I'll leave a link in the description for you to download it and for you to enjoy it on your Android device. Okay, guys, so once again, this is Borderlands 850. Um, thanks for watching guys, like, comment, and please subscribe, and I guess I'll see you guys later.